So the day Broadway went dark was supposed to be opening night for Six, a new musical. But the six wives of Henry VIII kept their heads, and on September 17th, they were back on stage trying to set their stories straight. Broadway's six are King Henry VIII's six wives, revealing their terror living in the house of Tudor to the tune of a half millennium later. It feels like a concert. Can I just say this show is a beautiful hybrid of a concert and a musical? And I'm like, this is the third Broadway show for Texas native Adriana Hicks. Her first time originating a role. She plays King Henry's first wife, his brother's widow. I think of her as a, a graceful warrior, but he was a jerk. It just didn't turn out well because they weren't able to produce a male heir, but still produce an heir nonetheless. Each glammed up queen from Aragon to Catherine Parr tries to prove she suffered more in her marriage to the notorious monarch. The king married his fifth wife, Catherine Howard, in 1540. Vixen or victim? Oh, interesting. Yes, definitely victim. It's actually her history of uh, sexual abuse uh, from the time that she was 13 up until she was beheaded at 18 or 19. So she was a victim who was led to believe that everything was actually her fault, but that's absolutely not true. Broadway newcomer Samantha Pauly sees her liberated queen as full of life, like a pop princess with a potential audience of 1100. There is no fourth wall. We are encouraging people to dance and sing along if they know the words, and it fuels us because we're able to see all of their excitement. Sorry, no, sorry, no. What? Shut down for more than a year, rehearsals for the long-delayed Broadway opening started in August. Tony-winning producer Kevin McCullum couldn't resist the London hit, written by two 22-year-old Brits. In live theater, youth writing about the world they see is very different than the world I might see now. So I am always thirsty for those shows with new voices and new writers and ushering them into our culture that's called Broadway. Vaccination verification and ID out, please. Ticket holders are encouraged to arrive early to get online to show proof of vaccination. Along West 47th Street, fans eager for live theater respect the rules. I just say thank you taking care of themselves and keeping us safe too. From being in a diverse cast to the retelling of the Queen's stories and their shining armor, the actresses say Six is an empowering story in their lives too. I literally feel like I'm like a, a superstar but then I'm like, no, Adriana, you're just Adriana. You're just going out there and having fun. The fact that I am originating a principal role in a Broadway show is not something I ever thought that I would do. So we're just really, really excited. Really excited to be back.